They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Brady's going to take the snap from the shotgun. Got the completion. Ball's on the ground. The defense has the football. The tackle was made. You got to protect the football on the offensive side. When you don't protect it the way these defensive players can run, you're going to get in trouble, and that time it results in a fumble. The Jets ready to take over the football. Amaro's a tight end, but lined up in the backfield for this play. They go screen with Ridley. What a hit, and the ball falls incomplete. That's interesting. As you watch the receiver trying to make that catch, he knew the defender was close, so he didn't put all of his heart into it. The defender made a nice hit and knocks the football out to the ground. Second down and 10. Brandon Marshall brings it in. First down here after the completion. On this passing down, the defense comes out in the nickel. From the shotgun, he's got the catch. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. The Jets call the timeout. They're first. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Wide receivers are bunched up. Here's Decker. Well, that's just a good old physical run by the offense there. And it's good for a few yards and gets them another first down. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. From the shotgun. Here's Decker. Decker is tackled down. And there's a timeout, so we'll take one with them. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. So they complete that one, yet it's still second down. The defense comes out of the time. Fitzpatrick standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. Unable to bring it in. Graham's going to be so mad at himself for dropping that football because receivers, you never know when your chance is going to come. And then finally, you get open. They call a play where you're the, the primary guy. It's right there, and you drop it. Well, don't get down on yourself. Stay up. The football will come your way again. The Jets call a timeout here. They have zero timeouts remaining. 40-yard field goal attempt coming up. The kick is good. That does it here for the first half. Patriots trail with this one. We'll be back in a moment with the first half analysis. We welcome you in now for the EA Sports Halftime Report presented by Verizon. Now let's take a look back at the first half. The Jets are happy to be sitting in the locker room with the lead. The Patriots didn't play their best. They'll need to be at their best now to come back. So here we go. Let's take a look at some of the highlights from the first half. Patriots on offense early in the first. Dobson's found coming across the middle. And he'll end up at the 30-yard line before being tackled. Now to late in the second. Ridley's going to take off here. And finally on play 12, they score, giving them an early lead. Staying late in the half. Here the defense will come up with the pick. Revis is the one taking it back for the score. The lead now at 14. Gostowski has it teed up now for the start of the second half. And Curley's going to run this one out. And he's going to be taken down well short of the 20. Let's mark him at the 15. The Jets are set for their next possession. Ridley lined up in the backfield. Ridley's tackled down. Power running. A lot of teams in this league don't even do it anymore. This team, they can power it up in there and pick up those tough yards. Second down coming up. 
They'll go with the extra tonnage here with the jumbo set. Catch made. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. That's an awesome job by the offense picking up this first down here in the second half. They've got a big lead. It's not about scoring anymore. It's just about milking that clock. And that is an art this team is good at. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. They are all over them behind the line of scrimmage. And a loss of one. Third down following the run. For this play, they'll go with two tight ends. Finds his mark, and he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. This team, one of the better tackling teams in the NFL, and they play the situation perfectly. They give up the short completion. They come up and make the tackle. Now we have a fourth down. McCourty's got it now. He's brought down. First down coming up. Tom Brady under center. Gets the handle here. Can't find space, and this will be a loss of one on the play. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. Brady's back in shotgun formation. Trying to work that left side. Brady sends it to Dobson. You just can't expect your defensive backs to cover that long. Uh, it's good coverage initially, but the quarterback had all day long, and sooner or later, these great wide receivers are going to get open. The Patriots take it from the 33. Brady, play action, and the pass incomplete. The punter awaits the snap. He's going to try to return it. He's going to be tackled right around the 24-yard line. First down, offense ready for the snap. Ridley's in the backfield, single back set. Ridley's tackled down. Defense has ruled today's game, Phil. Yeah, the defense is dominating, and I'm going to be honest, it's fun to watch. Every once in a while, I like to see the offense take a beating to this, the NFL. It's all about the offense. It's nice to see the defense dominate. And Ridley, and he gains maybe three. Ridley is able to show everybody why he should get the football more. Good job that time finding his way and picking up a first down. Offense lines up here. Running back in motion here. Feeds him again. Rock for a loss on that play. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. Split backfield here. Fitzpatrick's going to take it from the gun. Looking to the right side and throw it. And gains maybe four. Well, they complete the pass, Jim, but doesn't get the first down. Sooner or later, you got to throw one down the field. The offense needs 10 yards here on third down after that last completion. Third down and 10. Fitzpatrick's got it in the gun. Looking across the middle, Decker's got it. First down. When you play this uh, cover three defense, just kind of sit back there and try not to give up the big play. That is great. The problem is you give up all these short plays. How about that throw by the quarterback on that slant pattern on top? That's a tackle right near the 48. There is nothing like big running plays for an offense. It just makes the offensive lineman feel powerful, 
gives great confidence to the play caller. There's a reason why this guy's in the top 10 rushing yards so far this season. That will bring us to the end of the third here in East Rutherford. We'll return in a moment for the beginning of the fourth quarter. We're back, and this game has not been close. Second down after going to the ground game, the first play. Split backfield here. The final quarter underway now with this snap. And now they'll be on the other side of the 50 after this play. There has been good pass protection for the quarterback all day long. He has not been sacked much, and he throws it there and gets another completion. Davis, a tight end, but now shifted into the backfield. Tack was made, and the first down is picked up. Always important to know where you are in the football field. That time, a good job by the ball carrier. Just ekes out a first down. Nice job. Three, 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 three. Over, over. First down at the 41. They hand it off to him again. And he's going to be tackled right around the 35-yard line. What a beautiful long run by the running back. Uh, once again, he just proves why he's one of the best in the NFL. He's in the top 10 so far this year. Coming up, second down. Amaro's usually a tight end, but he's in the backfield this time. And off the mark on that short throw. That incompletion by the quarterback, hey, I give the quarterback no fault. That was just tremendous coverage by the secondary player. He's in position and able to uh, make the football be incomplete. Fitzpatrick's going to take the snap from the shotgun. Brings it into his body. And he's tackled, but not until he picked up the first down. The slant route, it's a timing route where the wide receiver plants his outside foot at five to six yards and catches the football eight yards down the field as he's going across the middle. The Jets from the 27. Here's Decker. That's a gain of six. When you talk about throwing the football into open space, that's almost always against zone defenses. That's what we saw that time. Good job by the quarterback throwing it in there. The long drive continues. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. Jim, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. They're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. What a drive this has been. It's Ridley. That's a gain of eight. The Jets know once they get inside the 20-yard line, you have to be able to run the football also. They can't be pass, pass, pass all the time. The offensive line comes through. Good, solid run that time. This has been a long drive so far. It's getting harder and harder in the NFL to score when you're this close to the goal line. So what will the offense do? They, they better be creative. That's all I know. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Marching down the field and taking their time. Once again, a running play. In the end, it picks up only a yard. The defense has got to be a little aggressive here. Your team is down. You've got to attack this offense. You don't want them to get in there and get another score. And now we reach the two-minute warning. I over again on second down. Play after play after play here on this drive. Ridley's tackled down. Tim, I love these situations. Third and goal, what are they going to call? They're going to run the football, they're going to go with the pass, and if it is the pass, I would look for something quick. Over, over. Mounting a serious drive, and he's across for the touchdown. Well, that touchdown just put the icing on the cake, Jim. Whatever you want to say, because now the lead's too big, not enough time for the other team to come back. Great job by the offense. The Patriots await the kickoff after giving up a devastating score for their side. The score is 24 to 0. McLean's going to take a knee, so this will come out to the 20. The Patriots bring their offense back on the field for their next drive. Quarters formation here for the defense. First down and 10. He 
had no time to get set. To be a great defensive back in the NFL now, you have to read the receiver. When those hands go up, you do the same, and that time the defense knocks the football down. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Brady standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. And he's forced to the ground. The Patriots are going to burn the first of their three timeouts right here. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. It's Brady looking long. Rebus nearly comes away with the pick on that pass. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. And Curley has got a chance this time. And tackled down at the 49-yard line. <laughs> The Jets getting set now for their next series. Wide receivers over, stacked over. up on this play. First and ten. He has the grab. Picks up about five. The pass play was good for five. Second and five coming up. Ryan Fitzpatrick will be taking this one from the gun. Drop back, shotgun formation, throws the pass. He's going to be tackled right around the 46-yard line. Third down on the way. Loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime. Fitzpatrick's back in shotgun formation. And Curley's going to pull in the bullet pass. First down here after the completion. Wide receivers are bunched up. Fitzpatrick's going to take it from the gun. Brings it in. Games 14. The Jets are going to burn the first of their three timeouts right here. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Amaro's playing out of position in the backfield here. Fitzpatrick's got it in the gun. Here's Decker. That's McCourty making the stop. And the offense will call the timeout. Chip shot here. No doubt about it. Put three on the board. All that animosity, all that hatred, all the buildup. And in the end, it was a win that was a one-sided affair. Yeah, it was in all sides. Everything you looked at, they got out hit today. They weren't as physical. They were not smart on the field. Even the design of what they were trying to do, the management of the game, that was wrong on the coaching side. Just one awful effort. What a memorable game this truly was. For Phil Sims, Danielle Bellini, and Larry Ridley, Jim Nance saying so long for now, and we leave you with the GMC Never Say Never moment of the game.